well, I've never, I don't think I've ever been to one, so this was really exciting to be here. I knew it was going to be nice because it's at the Four Seasons, and we thank them for allowing them to take over the hotel. It's great. Um, and I think I wanted to see the Oscars sitting amongst my peers. It's always yeah. awesome. You know, uh, of course, you dream about it. Not everybody does, but when you're young and this is your business, the business you want to be in, you dream about being there, you know, being on the stage, and then short of that, knowing someone that's on the stage. So it's, it's great. Tonight you do, hopefully. Common and John Legend. Talk about that. I'm so, so excited for them. That song is so moving. I remember when he originally wrote it and Ava saying that she needed something that was bigger and more emotional. And then he came with that. And I think he hit every note, no pun intended. And, you know, I have my fingers crossed and prayers up. Well, being an African-American woman as and an actress, I think this is the perfect place uh, for me to watch the Oscars. I mean, I could have either here or at home in my bed with my man. You know what I mean? Now, when it comes but to they got champagne in there. I was honored to be invited. And I think it's really important because this year all of the uh, African-Americans and other minorities are the talent. They're the people who are presenting and they're the people who are singing. But they're not the people who are up for awards. So I think it's important. I'm so happy that they put this event together so that we can come together and celebrate our, you know, people that are being seen in some form or fashion, but also making a statement that, you know, come on, you guys, this is 2015. Really? Are we still doing this? Really? <laughs> well, I guess the, the Oscars itself, you know, even though we have a lack of representation in the main venue, but we are very well represented here. So we're having fun, you know, watching them doing their thing and uh, hopefully one day we'll be part of it. Being at the African American Film Critics Oscar watching party is absolutely imperative, especially this year when the diversity or shall we say lack thereof is prominent in the front burner conversation of America. Um, diversity and inclusion is real and the African American Film Critics Association really speaks to that need. I hope that everybody understands how important this night is and what it represents so that we don't ever have it again.